Vai Pei. I'm lecturer in English and I'm teaching English subject. Good morning everyone. Today the lesson we are going to learn Relative Duties of Young Man is written by Henry Ward Beecher. Now let's first see about the writer Henry Ward Beecher. He was born in 1813, he died in 1887, was a renowned divine religious author and journalist. In the United States of America, he commanded large congregation. He published several lectures for young men, which went through several editions. Beecher in this lesson want to refresh the young minds with some thoughts respecting the various relations. For example, the relation which the young men sustain to their employers, to themselves and to the community or country in which they live. He offers some practical suggestions and instructions regarding the best method of fulfilling their duties towards various relations discussed in the lesson. So we know that Henry Ward Beecher, he wanted to refresh the minds of the young uh, stars about their relations which they have to sustain, maintain in our daily life, different kind of relation which he has kept. So we are going to see what kind of relation he is going to discuss. I desire to refresh the minds of the young with some thoughts respecting their various relation in life and with some plain practical suggestion and instructions with reference to the best method of fulfilling their duties in those relations. So in the first line, we see that Henry Ward Beecher, the wish of Henry Ward Beecher is to refresh Refresh means recalled the minds of the youngsters, young boys and girls with some thoughts respecting means regarding. So the one he would like to do is to recall the minds of the young boys regarding their various relations with some plain practicals, suggestions and instruction with reference to the best method of his fulfilling their duties in those relations. So, Henry Ward Beecher, what he wanted and he suggests some instructions with reference to the best method, the best kind of method he would like to adopt in order to fulfill the duties, those which they are related for the young boys. Henry Ward Beecher and why they palm is a curry gino hebam tamda. Hosikan gi naha rol singna. Moi gi relations mayam. We have so many relations. Relation ato ato pa mamanabay relation, employee ga relation, mother father relation. Si mayam se pazana keep up tau nangai mana practical lessons, suggestion, instruction. Pi ba sigi mana why the gi apam ba oy ba gi mana si irak pane. The young are those to whom we look for the future strength and for future good. And the longer we live, the more anxious we become that they who are to be the fresh. Recruits should be morally of right stature. So he want the young are those to whom we look for the future strength. So what we are talking about is the young girls and boys are the pillars of tomorrow. This is what is always said. This is a maxim. This is a proverb which everyone understood and everyone knew about it. Very familiar with these words. So Henry Ward Beecher, he said that the young are to those whom we look the future strength. Ahoy pithibi ki future strength se kanada lege hai bang tamda. Ahoy ki naha role sing. Hozik 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 inka lagpa. Hozik hozik naha oiri basse. Moi na abhavami oira pataradi. Ahoy ki future generation se we will be very strong. The strength of the future generation depends on the youngsters of nowadays. And the longer we live, the more anxious we become. That they who are to be fresh recruits. Fresh means new. Likewise, these youngsters are the ones who are to be recruited for the betterment of the next generations. And recruits means new members of the society. Mahoy mayam said new members oiba. Anoba recruit oiba, youngsters in oiba. Karamba recruitment moin oiba do say. Recruitment recruited to the next generation. Next generation Pagat Nangai or the new generation. This generation, these youngsters are very important. 
And these youngsters should be, how are they going to be? They should be moral of right, morally of right stature. Karan ba angang oira ka phagat ka doi no hai tamda. They should be of right stature. Right stature means of right moral character. In khalak ba naha rol sing se, kamai na karan ba mi oi na koi gi future strength oira ka doi no hai bam tamda. Mokhoi se morally right character. If they are moral, if they have a right moral character, at that time our future generation will be strong and we can make or we can proceed to a better world. Aduna Hazikan gi Naharul Singh, Natarga Hoziki, Angang Singh, Ladik Tamakpa Singh, Simeam se they are very important because the future depends on the youngsters of nowadays. Around them are peculiar temptation, trials, witching, cunning, insidious and forceful and we are obliged to see thousands falling by the way whose fall seems needless. Aduna karitawi around them akoi ki akoi bada moi ki akoi basida karilei there are some peculiar peculiar means very special normal oi da ba temptations me am karam ba noi bam tamda temptations evil things that can attract them and take them to the wrong way phat ta ba lambi da mohoi bu ching sin na ngai se moi gi surrounding the peak thanna le and they have to face a lot of trials test trial means test so they have to face a lot of test ashugum ba phat ta ba myam ahoi gi society da Lady, but see that Mohoi is a test of my own. Lady, Mohoi is a test of the trial. If they are able to overcome all these temptation and trials, they will become a very successful person, and they can become a very dependable new generation. Witching means bewitch. Yam, Mohoi is a attractive yam. Oi ba adu gum ba. Patta ba myam se. We call it bewitching, cunning. I'm cunning so ever. Insidious. Insidious means treacherous. Treacherous means alluring and harmful. Alluring the am oiba. Attractive the am oiba. Adoir su. Ahoy na chang si luba matamda. Very harmful oiba. Adukum ba mayam. Temptation mayam se. Ahoy ki surrounding the loin. Ahoy ki ahoy ba dalay ba nina. Si mayam se. Angang sing. Naharun sing ki da magta. Moy ki da magta. Trial. And something which they have to make themselves very strong so that ca they can defend themselves from this kind of temptation and evils which is around them. And forceful and we are obliged to see them, thousands falling by the way. Thousands and thousands of youngsters we saw falling by this temptation and evils. They are compelled sometimes. Pat the barum the chang si lubo su yam yawi. Oplik means compel, compulsion. And sometimes before knowing what is it is, they just fall into the temptation. Moin a hungry nay the pat the barum the moin hat the chang si lamba. Asi meam su moin the talk the banati. So we saw thousands of falling, uh, uh, youngsters falling for this temptation which are needless, which are unnecessary. Falling into this kind of Evil uh, temptation are very unnecessary. They like ourselves are to have but one chance in life. So like ourselves, we the older generation, the younger generation have also only one chance in life. One chance in life hai basic kari artha no hai matanda. Ahoy kise punsi ani hum laite. Once we were born, we have one life. One life labor taradi kari. We have only one chance in life. This is what the writer mean by it. We that are somewhat advanced in years, seeing how many perils there are around about that one chance, feel an honest desire that every advantage should be given to those who are coming to fill our place. So you see, we who are advanced, advanced in years, we saw many, many dangers around them. We saw dangers mayam, evils mayam. Temptation may am say, ahoy na, loy na, han na ura Perils means dangers. 
So, this dangerous temptation, if they did not protect themselves from it, if they did not defend themselves from it, they can fall into the trap of this temptation and which will spoil the one chance they have in life. Moina punsida amakhaktan chance lay basi, moina spoil tau jagadwini. And feel an honest, honest means strong desire that every advantage should be given to those who are coming to fill up this. Aduna, ahoy, moida gi, hitan ahan oi ba mi sing zina, we have a strong feelings to give a chance to those youngsters. Moi se advantage pi pi raga, moi gi damak da platform pi pi raga. Apabami am oi raga, generation lakada ba. Moi na same kat nangai say strong pillar oi na na bado. We are very eager to give that chance to young this youngsters. We can live but once, and life is usually molded and take its shapes very early. We can live only one life. Pun si si ako ina only one life lay lay. We live only one time in our life. Ako ina pun si ani hum lay te life ani hum lay te, and this life is usually molded. Molded means shaped. And takes its shape very early. Aduna, early stage ta ako'y gipunsi sa magis shape o irapa. Gada ba? Ako'y na character le gada ba? Natrika strong o gada ba do? At a early, at a very early stage. Yam ngan na si mayam sa how drabadi mo'y gida magtahayin awabat hula ga. They cannot become a dependable person for the society. I propose. I refers to this word bicha. I therefore propose on this occasion to consider the relation with the young sustained to their parents, their employers, to themselves and to the community or country in which they lived. So Henry Ward Beecher proposed to consider some relations which the young should sustain. Sustain means maintain. And what kind of relation we are talking here? Relation to their parents, relation to their employers, relation to themselves and the relation to the community or the country in which they live. Karamba relation no man is the The young has to maintain certain relations and those relations he has mentioned here are relation to their parents. Ima ipaga lainari bamari aduga ahoy gi employer ga lainari bamari aduga to themselves. Isa isa ga mari aigi wakal gi manung that we call it one kind of relation and the relation we have to maintain to the community. Akoi ki community si the karamba relation akoi na maintain tau gudo you know or to the country in which they live. So this kind of relations akoi na akoi ki lam country ki karamba relation na akoi na adopt tau gudo isi karamba relation na akoi na maintain tau gudo tham gudo isi akoi na lai riba wala si da country is the other number relations may I'm saying he would like to give some kind of suggestions and instruction to the youngsters to follow no young person should consider it an advantage to get rid of parental supervision and care no young person mean no youngsters should consider it an advantage to get rid of parental supervision and care Hujikan ki angang singa naharul na khali se kari no hai bama ramda. Mama ma pa ki makhada, direction ki makhada lai basi. They feel it irritating. Adho na, kana kana oi rasu. Any kind of youngster should not take it at advantage. Mama ma pa ki direction makhada lai da bama tamda. Mas advantage oi re, free oi re. Hai na khan bado, adho ki wakhal do. Thamoi da bane. Get rid of means become free of. Then parental means of parents, and supervision means directing one's activity and care. So when we are free from our parents' direction, we took it as a kind of advantage. Advantage ni hay nang ako na laujay. Ima ay pagi makada direction makada labor say we take it as a kind of something annoying and irritating. Nung ay tiyak ko. Ima ay pa na direction pira ka. Noin adu tau ba pati? Si tau ka doon ni, adu chat lura ka si tau ay hai ba may amsa koy gita magta, nahas sing gita magta, ang ang sing gita magta. It becomes very irritating and annoying. Adu na si kiwakal sa 
Nahaoribani. Though to the child there comes a period when it aches the year to be perpetually taught and restrained. Yet there is nothing in afterlife that can take the place of father and mother to him. So though to the child comes a period. Angang sing the moiki the kari la e period amahek la eba. Mama upana magin nakong the sita uga da bani. X means irritate. Perpetual means continuous. Continuously. Som som wahai si hai raga. Apat da batak ta uroi da bani. Sirom da chat loi da bani. Adukum bas maina. Every direction sa moina pira kanda. They find it irritating. Self restraint. Adu da restraint ta uriba. Check ta uriba do. Moina yaning de. And moi gida magta. Yam nungay ta ba. Yam saw ning ba. Matang yam lai. Adu bu. Angang si na khangka da badi. Karino hai batnam da. There is nothing in afterlife. Afterlife means future life. Noi na si ki naha oi ba ki matam si hindo raga. Ahan oi ba hitang chahi ahan oi silap matam da. Afterlife. Adu ni chahi ahan oi silap. Adu da na hoi na kyan tara kada ba se. Ima ipa ki mapham na tara ki. Ima ipa ki pauta hai ba se. Ahan oi silap kan da kyan tara ka ni. So this is what the youngster should know that the direction and the supervision of the parents were the best. This supervision cannot be replaced by any kind of advice or any kind of direction from any other persons. There is no other love like parental love. So here what we have to know again is there is no other things like parental love. Ima ipa na nung siba sigdagi he na nung siba sa ako ay napitibi da supang pangaroy da ba nung siba amani. There is no other friendship like a friendship of father and mother. Friendship ima na ba natrag ima na biga loy na ruraga loy na riba marido adu dagi he na pari ba sa ima ipa ga loy na riba friendship marido sa sigdagi he na paba napitibi si da na ako ay na. Kaya mapam na chat patara so angang sing naha o iba sing na so teng teng na roi sina huay da gi best friendship in the world. While the boy is yet sprouting into manhood he may be little impatient under restraint yet after year of independence will teach the young man that there were no advantages like those which his parents gave him. So you see the boy is sprouting. Sprouting means beginning to grow up into manhood. And he may be a little impatient under restraint. Moi na inkhalak po matang si da. Mama mapa ki direction da. Moi ki apam ba aning ba moong da lay ba ya da ba matang oi raka da. They feel impatient. Impatient hai ba matang da sounding ba. Patient oi da ba. Adukum ba. Revolting oi ba nature ama khaklai. Yet after every year of independence, well, it's the young man that there were no advantages like those which his parents gave him. Ado bu mana strong? Ahan oy sila ba matamda? Independent oy rak. Mama mo pa ki makada direction makada di dum punsi da lay baya da bni na. When he grows up, he has to be independent. He has to think independently. He has to find a way independently. So at that time, he will realize the benefit of his parental supervision. Man independent oy rak ba matamda? Mama apa ki advice lawak tabah matam da lawak tabah matam lakadoi ni mana masa na decision lawak da ba adu matam da mama apa ki advice da pau tak se kaya muk value oir eh kaya muk magi da mak tapai hai bese mana adu da kian tara kadoi ni young man there are no person that will teach you the truth so faithfully there are no person that know your faults so well. They are not so disinterestedly considerate for your well-being as father and mother. So the young man, what you should realize is there is no other person in the world who are very truthful and faithful to you like your father. There are no person that knows your faults so well. So there are none so disinterestedly. Disinterestedly means without personal interest, considerate. Consider it means thoughtful for your well-being as father and mother. Aduna, angang si nahasin na kanggadab si matkarino hai bamta. 
इमा इपाद की हेन ट्रुटफुल फेटफुल मनब गांगीरदब से इमा इपा नतन कनाम लेते एंड दे आर द पर्सन हू नोस अ फॉल्स वेरी वेल मोई खतन अखोई की अरब अचुब है लोन फजन खंग से इमा इपाद की हेन मेती करीम मोदी बेनीफिट होगदब लेतब मोदी कानगलब नब अदरसु मचाई चंग हंबीब अगुब मी है इमा इपा नतन पुनसी अखोन फंगदबने द वेलूस द थट्स द कंसिडरेशन विच वी रिसीव फ्रॉम आर पेरेंट्स आर द मोस्ट प्रिशियस एंड द मोस्ट वेल्युएबल थिंग्स विच वी विल नेवर फाइन इन एनी आदर प्लेस अखोन वी हेव टू रिमेंबर इट वेरी वेल दिस वन बीसाइड्स नो न्यूज पेपर नो पुल पीट नो ट्राइब्यूनल और of any kind ever discuss or touches those questions that belongs to the family or converse of the family so that is what we found here all over the world no newspaper no pulpit no tribunal will ever discuss the close discussion which you have in your family newspaper the so koi na phangoi pulpit hai badi platform for preaching especially for the priest Tribunal means board of judges. Board of judges mayam, a single mayam, newspaper mayam, wahai bhabu mayam. Kya mo koi na para, but tarasu. There is nothing to compare with the conversation among the family members. Converse of the family hai badi conversation among the family members. A koi na imong manung the discuss ta uraga. Ama ama ga simple discussion the a koi na learn ta uriba, tamiba wahai mayam. नग अफब मैम से अखोन न्यूज पेपर दस फंगो बोर्ड ऑफ जजेस असंग मैम की मरक फंगो एंड नो पुल पीट नो प्रिचर कैन प्रिच इन द पुल पीट अबाउट दिस काइंड ऑफ प्रिचिंग विच वी गेट फ्रॉम फैमिली कॉन्वर्सेशन वी के नॉट एप्रोच इन दिस आम लाइट डिस्कोर्स टू द फैमिली विजडम विच ब्रिंग्स इन्फॉर्मेशन होम टू द वेरी स्पॉट where it is needed in individual character as father and mother do at the nightly fireside so we cannot approach at arm length arm length means distant distant conversation cannot bring the familiar wisdom which you can get at the right moment akoi na hek apam bagi moment hek matam da apam bagi hek matam da akoi ki wisdom lak pa अखोन पृथ्वी फेस तब गंबी ज्ञान लाप से वी गॉड इट फ्रॉम वेर डिस्टेंट कॉन्वर्सेशन गुम फंगो वी गॉड इट फ्रॉम द फैमिली डिस्कसन विच वी यूज टू हेव विथ अ मादर एंड फादर बीसाइड फायर साइड अखोन मई मनाक फमीनग इमा इपाग फमीनग वारी साब मैम ज्ञान मैम अखोन ले विजडम मैम अखोई वाखल से पृथ्वी बु फेस तब गमीब एनी सरकमस्टेंसेस फेस तब गमीब अब विजडम पीरप से अखोन डिस्टेंस रिलेशन डिस्टेंस कॉन्वर्सेशन मीग डिस्टेंस होना वारी सानूब फंग सूम कदाई फंगदनो है इमा इपाग अखोन मई की मनाक नग फैमिलीद अखोन कई तौर फंगबद खतना असंब अखोद पीब गमगनी आई पास नेक्स्ट टू कंसीडर सम ऑफ योर ड्यूटीज टू एम्प्लॉयर्स अखोन ममांग है पेरेंट्स का यंगस्टर्स कहब रिलेशन अखोन मेटेन तौद वाट कैंड ऑफ रिलेशन वी हेव टू मेटेन वी हेव ऑलरे डिस्कस इन द अबाव पेराग्राफ ना वो मूव टू द इन द नेक्स्ट पेराग्राफ योर रिलेशनशिप विच यू शुड कीप विथ योर एम्प्लॉयर आर जी दाउट अगेन आई पास नेक्स्ट टू योर to consider some of your duties to employers and this branch of our subject includes a wide range so the next relationship which we need to keep is a relationship between you and your employers and this branch is of a wide subject sina karino ai bam tam da ai gi ithak thong ba ai gi employer ai bu hire tawbi ba ai gi boss hai tare adugum baga करब रिलेशन नो अगर थमगद 
And when we come to this point, this subject, it includes a white rents. Yam white rents. Yam parks hanna. Discuss the obatare identity. I ask you to consider in the first place your relation to employers from the highest point of view. Do not vulgarize your secular relation but make a matter of religion of them. So the first thing he asked to maintain the kind of relationship with employer is we have to put the relationship with our employer and myself to the highest point of view. Very low oiba. Natraga value later bana thamgada bana te. Aiga employer ga relationship te. We have to put it in the highest point of view. Do not vulgarize. Vulgarize means do not make your relationship vulgar. Vulgar means maung cha da ba. Yeng bata nungai da ba. Ta bata nungai da ba. Adu kumba. Point of view sing mayam do. Adu mai na aiga relationship aiga boss ka thamoy do ini. Aiga employer ga. And then we have to be religious. We have to maintain a kind of religious, religious relationship. Dona, ahoy gi, boss, ahoy gi, employer siya. Ado kung bor relation to ahoy na maintain tau gada bani, even though it is not religious. Secular hay basi na not religious hay bani. A relation between an employer and an employee is cannot be considered as religious, but we have to keep it as a kind of religious relationship. Ado na religious. Relationship ki mo ong da ako ina si tambatay even though it is not a religious things, it will make all the difference in the world. Whether or from high-minded and generous point of view, you look at your duties to your employer from a law and selfish point of view. Aduna, what he say is he asks the employer employee to look at the relationship as a kind of religious relationship. And with this, you will realize that it makes a very different kind of relationship. Ako ay na sigong ba relationship sa maintain to bang ang bata na di? Ako ay na kari pang kani, we will see all the difference. Ako ay na yamt, kari ay sila law o ay na han bagi mahuta. Ako ay na smay na kind of something very religious, very fine. Dumay na han bata na di, we will know all the difference. Instead of looking at your employer from a very law and selfish point of view, very law and selfish point of view, the whole employer is being bombarded. The whole na pangada ba na talaga? The whole na relationship the person na maintain tau bang amoy? Adun na whole na as a kind of religious matter the whole na thambata aradi. The whole na si we will see the difference. So our relationship to employer is also very important. Next paragraph, we will move. Be sure after having entered into any relationship to faithfully perform your part. So the, the thing, what we should be sure is, we should be sure that after entering a relationship, we have to faithfully perform our part. Relationship se karam boi tara su. Eike employer ga oi rambatai, eike friend ga oi rambatai. Two partnership. Aiki friend ki oi taro so aiki pat to head relationship haura pa matamda. I have to be very faithful. Aiki pat to ay na faithfully perform to ba tapo. Aiki pat to karam ba no? Kamay na oi doi no habido. We have to perform it very faithfully. Be careful that you do not fall into a narrow, selfish, calculating mood. Ado na karino relation na masay ko na selfish oi raga, narrow minded oi raga, calculating, calculating ay ba di? Benefit lah kata bah, la oi doi bah, natal ka, papa pata bah, semua calculating muda lay roi dah bani. Guard most particularly against measuring what you do by the character of the person for whom you do it. Remember that you're always two parties in every partnership, and if you happen to be placed under persons of merit and worth, you owe it first to them and secondly to yourself to act in a high and honourable way. So what we have to guard most here is. Measuring what you do by the character of the person. Karek ahoy na miwoy ba ma ay ki friendship partner dugi. Pabab pata bigi matung inna ay na measure tau raga pangto kada ba na taraga ay ki part ama do play tau bado ado tau roy da bani. Ahoy na ahoy da ki guard tau bado basi ati ni mana pagi pao paroy to o we have to do our part. We are two parties and we have to work to make the friendship work to make the friendship flourish. 
Aduna Sigi relationships a point of Panangai di Karino Hevum Tamda. We have to do our part by not measuring the character of the other person. And secondly, we have to act in a very high and honorable way. Mana parasu patrasu. We have to act in a very high and honorable way. Sukumba relationships we should try to maintain. But if an employer are as mean as can be, you can you never can afford for your own sake to act in any except a large, magnanimous and manly way. There is no excuse for your acting or unfaithfully under any circumstances. So you see, but when we maintain a relationship, if our employers are mean, mean means very, very cruel, selfish. So as mean as can be means extremely selfish. My name is selfish or Akanda. It becomes a great effort from the part of the employee to maintain a very honorable relationship. Yam Paba Yam smooth over relationship maintain to Bodumatamda. Employee Amagidamakta. Yam Awab Ama Oire. You can never afford for your own sake to act in any except a large, magnanimous and manly way. Adumatamda. Awab of Gidamak Awab Amadito Adorasu. We have to act in a magnanimous way. Magnanimous means noble way and manly way. Aduna. Manly way, noble way ni haidana. Akhoi gi tarap ta gi di. Akhoi gi sai ta gi di. Yam wakhal apaba. Asen ba ki relationship to. Akhoi na maintain tau na na ba. Hoot na ga da ba ni. There is no excuse for your acting previously or unfaithfully under any circumstances. Aduna. If we acted previously, irritably, ay ki employer ama na yam. Selfish way raga ayong wanda. Tina tina tau biba matamda. Aina irritating oi na yam sauni aga laiba matamda. We cannot excuse for that unfaithful behavior under any circumstances. Aduna, employer amana patabatarasu. It is a duty of her employee to act in a very noble and manly way because we cannot say that I become irritated, I become angry and I acted very unfaithfully towards this employer because he is mean to me. Adukumbe excuse to na siyem bayade, hai bayade, asiki maramna, we have to, even though the, the employer is very mean, we have to keep a very faithful and a very noble relationship, at least from our side. So with this paragraph, I will wind up my class today. See you again next time.